You don't think I would have done it? No, oh, man, I know you wouldn't. You don't think I can keep Lori or Carl safe? I didn't say that. Or my baby. Is it gonna have to be me, too? Rick, you can't just be the good guy and expect to live, okay? Not anymore. I'm not the good guy anymore. To save Carl's life, I would have done anything. Anything. Now, Lori says you're dangerous. But you're not gonna be dangerous. Not to us. Not to me. Not anymore. How about you look at me? You and Lori. I get what happened. When I figured it out, and I figured it out pretty quickly, I wanted to break your jaw. Let you choke on your teeth. But I didn't. That wasn't weakness. It took everything. That is my wife. That is my son. That is my unborn child. I will stay alive to keep them alive. You don't love her. You think you do, but you don't. Now, the only way you and me keep on is that you accept everything I just said right here, right now, and we move forward with that understanding. When it started, it was just... It was a couple weird stories on the news. It was so quick. Everything, it just happened. Two weeks later, I'm in the hospital and there were soldiers shooting people in the halls. They were shooting people, man, not walkers. Then the walkers came through. You know, I tried to get you out. I tried, but we weren't gonna make it. Man, there was no way and I knew it, but, but I couldn't live with it. I couldn't live knowing, but I had to. I didn't keep Lori and Carl alive, man. They kept me alive. I want you to know that I didn't look at her before that. Brother, if I could take it all back, I would. I want to check the ropes. Mm-hmm.